Gavin, thank you very much for joining us. Um, obviously, coming in off the back of two wins this week, it's been a fantastic week for the club. Uh, give us your thoughts on both the Barrow performance and the Braintree performance. Yeah, I mean, um, I think it's been a long time coming. I thought um, the first few games we've had, uh, we just missed out. Uh, well, I think we've been unfortunate, but I mean, now I think we've got that bit of momentum now. Everyone's still confident, so to get them two wins is is brilliant for us. I think you could see on the pitch after the the brain tree performance the the sense of relief as we as GK scored that that 85th minute penalty. Yeah, definitely. It's like all of our hard work and season and training that like we still work, we're all working hard in training just to get that win. And uh, now it's calm. I think now we just get a little bit of relief off us and we can relax a bit, but then um, and just just grow more in confidence every day. And for yourself as a defender, it must be must be a fantastic feeling to get the, the three clean sheets that we've had in the in the last three matches. Yeah, definitely. We we'll, yeah, that's what we work for to get a clean sheet. That's first first and foremost what we got to do. So um, to get three in a row, I mean, it's brilliant for us. And obviously, the, the back four has been a little bit more consistent. Have Alex Davies been out injured, so it's, it's usually been it's been Goodliff and Pennell and yourself as well. But what's it been like? Is that easier for you as a defender? Um, well, whatever it gets put to us, we got to deal with. So, um, I mean, there's a lot of players there, so it's competition for places. So everyone's got to um, just try and stay in the team. So it's, it's it's good for all of us. I mean, everyone's there's even Nani coming back now, so that's that's another player coming in. So I think everyone's got to step up the game. And you've mentioned it there briefly, uh, competition for places yourself. There's quite a lot of players fighting for your your position. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? No, it's always a good thing because um, you can never relax and uh, you've got to try and keep working hard and it's basically just keep your place in the team. And for yourself, returning to Dagenham this season after being there, you know, a couple of years ago, what's what's it been like coming back into the club again? Yeah, I mean, I've always I've always um, looked at Dagenham when I was uh, at other clubs. I've always seeing how they're doing and um, obviously my brother's there so I was watching him play here and uh, it's close to my home so I think it's a, it's a great club. And on Saturday we're up against Chesterfield and the last time we actually played Chesterfield you were in the, the squad in 2013. What, how tough of a game is it going to be against them? Yeah, I mean they're a great side. They um, um, they won their, what was it, their first two games I think it was and obviously they've had a bit bit of a bad run now, but um, you can't take that into things. You just got to you just got to go go there, expect it, there, thinking we can win. And you're going up against one of your your former Daggers Daggers teammates in Zavon Hines. How much of a threat could could he be for them? Yeah, I mean, we, we, everyone knows what Zav can do. A very attacking player, a very skillful player, and he scores goals as well. So he's 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 a threat. And obviously we're looking to keep this run going. It's gonna it's gonna be a tough, but and you know Mike Nan's teams are always well suited and good in this league. So what, what's it gonna be like? Yeah, it's it's gonna be a hard game. No matter what what team you play in this league, as you can see, uh, every game we've had has been hard. Um, if we just carry on what we've been doing for the last three games, then then I think we can come away with a win.